This fight is so tedious. We're goddamn close. One, maybe two? Uh, assuming I don't fucking miss. There we go. Yeah, we did it. Okay. <laughs> we can move on with our lives. Ah. Oh. He has gone crazy. He has started laughing. The strongest man I've ever known. Not bad yourself. Local trash don't compare. Uh, doesn't compare. Think so? Thanks. Guess I mean something coming from the infamous Lord of the Night. Uh -huh. Eh? You know Bobby? Sure I do. You're going more, uh, grow much about you. You really were a big deal around here, huh? You know there was something different about you. Never trust the rumors. I ain't as big a deal as they say. But enough about me. Tell me why you're so single-minded about shaking folks down for money rather than doing something productive with your time. Oh. You really want to know? I guess I can tell you. It's because my dad told me to do it. Oh. Uh -huh. Well, I learned it from watching you. Uh, huh? Your old man. When I moved out of my parents' house, my dad told me I was a man now, and I had to make my own money and fend for myself, so that's what I'm doing. You can't go find a regular job, because being on someone's payroll isn't really what fending for yourself is about. Maybe you dependent on others, right? I mean, Kawahashi, you're... I, I guess that's a way to understand that. Okay. Pretty sure that ain't what your uh, dad meant, but uh, wait, I thought you were just getting money to have fun with. You're making all your cash this way? Uh huh? Uh, if I don't be pull up, I can't eat or pay rent. Your dad had way too much faith in you, <laughs> letting you live on your own. Whatever. You see how things stand? Get more money ready for the next time we meet, okay? How is that fending for yourself? Guess I'm not getting rid of this guy, but it's very clear of him when my wallet's too fat. Or, you know, I just don't suck and lose. There's that too. Uh, speaking of having all this money. Upgrades! Can I get an upgrade? And the answer is yes. Yes, I can. Uh, alright. That's everything I can buy there. Will I have enough? Uh, yeah, I should. And then I'll have like 20 something mil left over. 27, looks like. Okay. Uh, your weapon durability won't drop when wielding a bat as long as you remain calm. So the, uh, the the calming towel could actually be useful for the uh, weapon master spo uh, portions, apparently. If you had a weapon you really liked or something. What for bats or something? Or uh, not bats, uh, fucking handguns around here somewhere. Because yeah, uh, that'd be interesting. Oh, it doesn't look like there is. All right. Unless it's not a red marker and said it's a fucking cyan. No, doesn't seem like it. All right. Well, that's all the upgrades we could do. Let's go talk to Rudder Boy. Aaron John, uh, Aaron Coon, Chad. Let's what to say, Chad. Aaron Coon. Coming to see you. Aaron Coon. Hey, that's Aaron Coon. Looks like he's feet are killing him again. Aaron Coon. Talk to my. Ah, oh, no, I'm really screwed. Hey, what's wrong? Oh, hello. It's my feet. They're killing me again. I think I'd walk again if I rest a while, but <sighs> can't say I didn't warn you, right? Yes, you did. I'm sorry. Don't tell me you're running errands again. 
Yes, I am. Um, I had to deliver this absorbent sheet in a hurry. <sighs> absorbent sheet. Why is there an absorbent sheet? What am I going to do? You got a major injury worse than you. If you explain why you're late, you'll understand, won't you? But she said she has plans. But I'll get into her in a hurry on my buster. See. Um, maybe. If you have time. Do you think you can deliver this absorbent sheet to her? What? I gotta run an errand so she can wipe her face? Sorry. Is it too much to ask? The idea of me running an errand's flat out nuts, but I'd like to peek with the girl who's making him do all this. Must be some kind of special. She must be some kind of special. She's gonna run Aaron Coon into the ground at this rate, maybe I can set it straight. <sighs> Alright, fine, I'll be your delivery boy. Y you will? Uh. Sure. So, where's her sweetheart at? Thank you so much! She's waiting on the footpath along the river on the Sunbury uh, Street side. Got it. The river path, uh, footpath on the Sunbury Street side. You rest up till you're good enough to walk. Hi. Oh, well, thank you. Here's her absorbent sheet. Sheets that are absorbent. Let's get to her as soon as possible. Uh. Yeah, I'm on it. <laughs> My Aaron Coon's errand boy now. I am the errands boy, oh. errand boy. Is that was she? That did. Uh, something boring. Oh, oh, up there. I can't remember what side of the fucking river she was on. Probably the north one. Actually, didn't he say north side? Hold up. Shiny? Shiny! Yuri uh, Ko Kogawa Type A. Really? That was our fifth telephone card. Congratulations, me. You have now become more of a pervert than you had before by just watching the. Oh, hey, million. Yen yeah, vending machine. Give me. What do I get? It's a shiitake mushroom. Boring. Huh. Where's Aaron Coon? I told him I needed an absorbent sheet like now. What? Try to keep it waiting. Excuse me? And who are you? Aaron Coon uh, hurt his foot and he can't run on it. So he begged me to get this to you. And it over the absorbent sheet. What the sheet? Is that right? Well, whatever works, thanks. <sighs> hey, how about a little concern for the guy? Don't bother you at all that he's in pain? Huh? No, oh, Wibby! What's the holdup? Oh, Tobo Coon. Sorry, Aaron Coon was kind of slow today. This man here brought what we needed, so we're good. <sighs> nice man. I was getting really sweaty, too. <laughs> Anything for you, Tobo Coon? Better whip that Aaron Coon into shape, though. Gotta give him some tough love so he's never late again. Mm. No problem. Hey, what the shit? Hmm? What the sheet? Excuse me? Wasn't you who requested that? Aaron Coon thought he was doing it for you, so he busted his ass to get it. Huh? Doesn't matter. <laughs> what Tomo Coon wants, I want too. We're totally going steady now. <laughs> yeah, Aaron Coon's usually good at his job. Quick, courteous, and free. Of course, he doesn't know we're an item now. These assholes. They don't give a rat's ass about Aaron Coon. Kill them all, Majima. Kill them all, throw them in the river. I mean, drugs! Wait. I mean. Doesn't the movie start to, uh, soon, Tomokun? We better go. Oh. Yeah, come on, babe. What? Hey, before you go, I'm gonna need you two to make me a quick promise. Oh? We don't know you shit, man. What do you mean? Aaron Coon has run his last errand for you. This stops now. You already got plenty out of him. Now let him go and stop toying with his feelings. <sighs> Dude, why would I make a promise like that? A good errand boy is tough to find these days. Huh? You shouldn't talk so <clears throat> You shouldn't talk so big, stick man. Tomokun could wipe the smirk off your face real easy. Really? Because I want my ass with guys like Tomokun. Uh? Oh, you want to get it? Uh, or, uh, <clears throat> mm, wrong voice. Oh, you want to get it on? Cool, cool. You can be my personal errand boy. Then we'll have to. <laughs> <laughs> if you win, I'll run errands for you all over town. Bare ass naked with a property of Tomokun tattoo. You, you're going to regret talking shit. Um, <clears throat> damn it, boys. <laughs> Don't give out on me like that. That time! Motherfucking bat 
time, dumb, stupid Tomokun. One good combo just wins. Yeah. So, uh, what do you say about making that promise? Or do you need more convincing? There you. I will, I will. I promise. We'll never make it run errands again. So sorry. Uh, wait, wait, Tobacco, cool. what about the movie? Well, I managed to get him to stop abusing Aaron Coon's generosity, but do I tell him the truth? Hi. Hmm? Oh, hey, if it ain't Aaron Coon, you okay to be running again? Yes, a little rest was all I needed. But anyway, did you get the observer cheat to her? Uh. Yeah, I made the drop, but. But. Let's tell him the truth. <sighs> well, I hate saying this, but that woman actually has a boy. I know. What? You don't need to say it anymore. I actually saw her walking around with this handsome looking guy the other day. He looked happy. But I couldn't ask her about him. I was afraid of learning the truth. Because you can't handle the truth. Wait. Aaron Coon. <sighs> Still. Kinda rips her hard out to know for sure. I mean, this is a reality check I needed. I'm not gonna run uh, any more errands for her. Good, that's for the best. Of course, who knows what'll happen when I fall for the next girl, but that's just the kind of guy I am. Always running. Nothing wrong with being the kind of guy a girl could depend on. But it's all about respect. If you both have an equal share of it, then nothing can tear you apart. <laughs> Here's up with the next lady you fall for treats you with the same love and care you got for her. Hi. Uh, yes. I can't thank you enough. You gave me the best on these sneakers and you did so much more. <clears throat> He's a chill. Yeah, it ain't much in the grand scheme of things. Yeah. No, no, it's simply not true. If I only, if I could only repay you for your kindness somehow, <sighs> that's why my knees are bad. <laughs> Is there anything I could do? I'll be happy to do it for you. I'm willing to run anywhere. <laughs> really got a thing for running. Hi. Yes, if there's anything I can do for you, please don't hesitate to ask. Sure, you got it. Okay, I'll be going now. Aaron's on the run. Much respect. I don't know. Aaron Coon will be waiting for you on the Sultan Bori footpath. He eagerly looks forward to running errands for you. He eagerly awaits running errands. Eagerly. A little too eagerly. Hello, kitty. Goodbye, kitty. And I run. I run so far. <clears throat> oh. oh, hello. Need me to run any errands for you? I'm going to lose something for you. Something I'm going to run different bits of a trick. Sure. <laughs> Hi. Sorry to keep you waiting. I got a steamed bun. Cool. A little wood, but I'll be having to run errands for you again as soon as I catch my breath. At least I has an air boy. Aaron Coon. Yeah, pretty much. I guess. I don't know. Alright, I think... I think besides Mahjong and some other random bullshit that we could be doing... Like the shot bar with darts and pool, and the shogi player, and the mahjong parlor, and the arcade with popular games that we've been at, actually. We are, uh, we should be good. Let's, uh, let's go sleep till the next day and actually continue the main fucking storyline since I've spent, like, I don't know, six hours on not continuing the main storyline. All mice can be taken apart, Kinka. Just how much you're willing to try to figure it out. Oh, Matia, Majima. Hey, hold up, Majima. Oh, wait, all right. This kind of thing is actually fully uh, fucking voiced. Uh, I almost forgot. Odessa,の門にあって言うたら心当たりあるやろ。Odessa。望みの引き抜きなら山形と話はついとるで。支配人が納得しても。俺らが納得するか。<笑> Nothing 
客には通用しても俺らに土下座は通用せんでま試しにやってみてもええけどな<笑> It's like there's voice acting in this game. It's weird. Huh? Oki Aku Sama wa Kami Sama. Huh? Uchi no Mizu ni kita kaku ni nara dogiza demo suru shi kutsu demo nametaru. Seya miru. Kaku ya nai nara hanashi wa betsu. Mashite. Kenka uri ni kita chimpira nanzo ni. Mori ga yasashi to omou na. Oh god, I just wanted to go to bed, but now I'm getting attacked by certain Bora goons. Damn these goons. Whatever shall I do? Oh wait, bad. And done. Ah, uh, fully upgrading everything before fighting these guys. That was hilarious. すぎる。何なんやお前は。お前ら仕返ししたかったら店に来いや。客としてなら土下座でも何でもしたるわ。好きにせ。ただその後どうなるかは保証するぞ。お客様は。<笑> I'd like to imagine that there's been some customers that have taken that policy too far. And then there's like a fucking standoff in the goddamn shop that it's like, This aisle ain't big enough for the two kings of us or something along those lines. So it's so nice not having to fucking talk all the time anymore. And actually have, you know, cutscenes and whatnot that actually have voice dialogue. Possibly, Kinko? Possibly. Also, what is up with this fucking guy? Just staring at me from the other window. And then a random guy on the rooftop. And here comes... Oh, guy, apparently. What the hell is up with this cart dude? Cart dude, what is your problem? Chapter 3, a gilded cage completion bonus of 2 million yen earned. Not that I care. Chapter result, earned through battle, 21.5 million. Earned through business, zero, because we haven't unlocked that yet. Earned through minigames, 2.6 mil. Chapter completion bonus, 2 mil. Total, 26 mil. Which is worth 24 times 1.091 mil of Diet Member's monthly salary. I don't know what the fuck Diet Member's is, but their, month, uh, their monthly salary apparently is that. Chapter 4, Proof of Resolve. Three years ago, Cabarucho. Not in this era, KB. Not in this era. Oh. Play no are. Not the Kitan Yuruna. Ah. Mangaimon is say nash. 
同時マグミ経由で仕入れた正真正銘の本門や拳銃は全部で6丁1丁につき6発撃てるとして36発発射できる36発か相手は上野義治とその場にいる清和会の連中全員こないなとこ呼び出して何のつもりなんすか柴田はん担当直入に言います今日の上野義治の襲撃真島さん行かないでくださいどうしてそれをあなたと佐江島は今日出所直後の上野義治を都内のラーメン屋で襲うそういう計画ですよね実はあの計画ちょっと問題がありましてね予定を変更させてもらうことになりましたこのまま襲撃に向かえば堂島組長いや島野さんにも迷惑をかけることになってしまいます俺は行くたとえどんな裏があってもかまへん俺にとって佐江島はたった一人の兄弟なんじゃ真島さんでもそれじゃあ,あなたの身もうるさい関係ないわこっちはそないなもんそうですか、like uh, そ,ですかそれじゃ仕方ありませんねおいシバタ Pinko prefers 1988, Majima. Also, if you wondered how he lost an eye, there you go. He was stabbed in the face. Is that spark really necessary at the end there? <laughs> Nightmareville. <sighs> yes, yes, that spark was necessary. All right. Uh, is that it? Or is there more cutscene? More cutscene. Maybe? Nope, nope. No more cutscene. Apparently. Alright. Well, uh, in that case... 
Another shit night's sleep. I uh, gotta get to work. Not much else I can do right now. What else I can do right now? Oh. I didn't expect a more internal monologue there, Majima. At least, you know, like another line or two so I could finish up doing what I was doing. <laughs> Get back to the ground of the ground, not like I got any other options. Yeah, I mean, technically, you completed a chapter, Majima. There might be some uh, more sub stories available. Which ones, I don't know, but uh, you know, that's a possibility. But, you know, anyway. Or the phone game I wasn't playing earlier? I wasn't playing that phone game. Hmm? It's my pager. Dragon Tiger and come. Guess I'll swing by if I come. Uh, if I come? If I can. You could lean Baccarat. No, I'm not learning fucking Baccarat. Fuck that, fuck that card game. Why? Who invented that card game? I wish for them to be revived, assuming they're dead, and then killed again. After being tortured. And, uh, I see. We got more dispatch locations. Got it. Someone very drunk? That's about right. <laughs> 